you dreaming about buying your first home? Do you have your head stuck in the sand about what it takes to buy your first home? Okay, Patty and I are going to repeat, and you're going to repeat after us. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. You can do this. You can do this. But the first thing you got to do is you got to reach out to a lender because they're the one that's going to tell you what you can and can't spend comfortably. So go girl. Go girl. <laughs> so hi there. Uh, so the first thing we're going to do as a lender is I'm going to suggest that uh, six months prior to you buying a home that you pull your credit. I can't tell you how many times we have pulled credit and found mistakes that the borrower had no idea that they had. Collection items, the FICO score was Oh, I need you to run my husband's again. Oh dear. Okay. Sorry. We digress. <laughs> Anyways, a squirrel. Um, <laughs> so, uh, we want to make sure it's, everything is correct and that gives us time if there is a problem with anything, we have time to fix it. So about six months prior, pull your credit, you can pull it through me. Uh, you can go to annualcreditreport.com once a year for free and pull your credit. However, they won't give you your score. You have to pay for your score. There's a nominal fee on top of that to, to see what your numbers look like. But six months prior, do that. Um, after we've done that, I'll give you a list of goodies, which we will do off camera, um, of documentation. Don't worry, it's not bad. It's not going to you out. Anything. Little stuff. It's Little. not what you think. Yes. Easy peasy. Easy peasy stuff. Well, well if you keep your records. Complete. It's easy peasy. Yeah. <laughs> and everything is digital now. Usually right. you get your pay stubs, you know, online, your bank statements online. So most of it you can do digitally and you can get it to me just like that. So don't freak out about the documentation, but get with the team that's going to be able to walk you through this process. And that's what we do. We hold hands, but not with each other. <laughs> we hold hands with you. So this is basically our first in our quickie uh, first time buyer episode. Next time, once your lender has gotten you pre-approved, we're going to see what it's like to actually get in the car with your realtor and go looking for houses. Yes, and speaking of getting pre-approved, once I get the documentation, we'll talk about your loan product, options, pricing, down payment, and I'll go through all that with you, closing costs. We'll walk you through that entire process so you're not overwhelmed, you're not surprised. Um, I'd like to make sure that you understand everything completely. So, yes, next time, next week, we're going to have... Um, next week? Lauren driving in the car. Okay, I guess next week. <laughs> <laughs> or whenever we decide to post again. Um, we're going to go ahead and have Lauren in the car and we'll give you an example of what it's like to be looking for, for property. So I'm Patty Handy with American Family Funding. I'm Lauren Lefkowitz Grieger with Realty Executives Valencia. And feel free to reach out to us on Facebook, uh, comment here. Just be gentle with the comments, I know it's scary. Oh yeah, make fun comments. <laughs>